Welcome back to the channel guys. My name is Daniel. I make videos about Filipino martial arts to promote them. And in this video, we're going to be talking about single stick basics. So this is a video to get you guys started on training in Arnie, specifically with the single stick. And specifically, we're going to be talking about grip, stance, and a couple of basic striking patterns. So there are two kinds of grips that I use with a single stick. One is holding it all the way at the very end of the stick, and the other is holding it about one fist from the bottom. So the main difference between the two, holding it all the way at the end here gives you more reach and more range, while holding it a fist from the bottom gives you a little bit more control to manipulate the weapon. I would recommend using this to start out. It's more comfortable, and as I said, you'll be able to manipulate the stick a lot better. So for the stance, there's a bunch of different stances you can use depending on the context and what you're trying to achieve. The stance that I like to use is called the forward stance where my lead side or my lead weapon is in front of me. So since I'm right-handed, my right hand and my weapon arm is in front of me and so is my right leg. This allows me to get a little bit more reach or rather maximize the reach of my weapon. With the weapon's position, you can keep the weapon either here in front of you or here behind you. I prefer to keep the weapon here, so again, to maximize the reach, I want to get to my opponent as quick as possible. But keeping it here will allow you to generate a little bit more power, and it's a lot easier also for a beginner. Because when you start out here, there's a tendency for you to swing the stick back and then strike, which essentially telegraphs your strike. So again, keep it here if you can strike from this position. If that's too hard when you're starting out, keep it all the way behind here and strike from that position. And now here's a couple of basic striking techniques or striking patterns that you can use to get started in practicing. So first is the Ekis. Ekis essentially means letter X. And so you're going to draw a large letter X like this. Notice I'm shifting my weight from the forward stance to what we call a back stance. And as I'm shifting my weight, I'm essentially adding more momentum and more power to my strike. So that is the Ekis. It's two downward diagonal strikes that you can use to target the temple, the collarbone, the hands if they're in front of you and so on. The next pattern is called the Banda e Banda. And essentially, just like the Ekis, you're going from side to side, but you are keeping the strike in a horizontal plane, like so. So one and two. So the target points could be the side of the face, it could be the hip if you lower it a bit, or it could also be the hands and things like that. With a stick, you're essentially going for hard targets, or rather those are the ideal targets, as you want to meet a blunt weapon with a hard target, so to speak, bones. And the third pattern you can try starting out with is called a baba taas. And essentially, you're going to go strike down vertically here to the top of the head, and then next, thrust to the solar plexus. So downward and upward, thus baba taas, which means down and up. So again, you have the ekis, you have the banda e banda, and you have baba taas. So those are just a couple of basics for you guys to get started in practicing our knees, specifically with the single stick. Um, if you're watching this and you already have some experience, hopefully you were able to pick up something as well. If you guys have any requests for what to cover in the next video, let me know, leave a comment down below, I'll consider it. And until then, I'll see you guys in the next video.